Hi, welcome, Simon here, and hope you're doing well. In this video, I'll walk you through step by step on how to upgrade your M.2 drive in this Acer gaming laptop. So give an example that your C drive is almost full, meaning that you have a lot of games installed or a lot of video editing installed, right? You have a lot of data and your C drive is filling up and you want to upgrade to a larger drive and in this video i'll walk you through step by step from start to finish on how to do so so technically you do need to have two things in hand um, first of all you need to have the larger m.2 drive and you're not sure where to buy the hard drive i will link them in the description below go check it out and that link would direct you to either amazon or ebay where you can buy the replacement parts so technically you need to have two things because when you buy a new M.2 drive when you install it this hard drive here is just pretty much blank it doesn't have any information in it so therefore you might need to get a Windows 10 USB installer so this USB would install the Windows with the license key into that new one terabyte or larger SSD drive now there are other ways you can do it you can actually make your own windows 10 by going to windows microsoft website windows microsoft website allows you to download and make a bootable usb to install windows in the new thumb drive i'll make that separate video um i'll make that video in us I'll, I'll make that video i'll try to make that video separately okay just comment below and let me know if you need that uh, installation help now just to move forward i know i'm my introduction is very, very long here. I'll try to cut it short. I just want you to make sure you're clear not spending additional $99 on the Windows. USB is just a waste because the computer itself has a Windows in it already. Okay, so this the second way to do it is you want to check out in the link description below where I'll link it um, where you can clone your smaller drive to a larger drive. Okay, meaning that you buy a one terabyte assuming that you have this original hard drive here in your computer is too small and you bought a brand new M.2 drive what you can do is you can clone your 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 original drive over to the new drive cloning it over meaning that you carry all your windows your data your programs your games everything over from the smaller to the larger one i already made that separate video here check the link in the description below it will direct you on how to clone the hard drive all right, but in this process, I just want to walk you through how to upgrade the uh, M.2 to a larger drive. Okay, so the first thing you like to do is to remove all the screws. These are Phillips screws, so get yourself a Phillips screwdriver and remove all the screws. Okay, once you have removed all the screws, the next step is to remove the back cover. And what you want to do is you want to go ahead and make sure you have the right tools to separate the back cover. I'm using the metal prying tool to somewhat get myself a little bit in. And I'll be using the plastic prying tool to finish up the rest of it. Right, I do not want to scratch and and make a dent on the plastic so using a plastic prying tool is much better okay once you have removed the back cover you can actually see the entire computer here uh, meaning that the m.2 drive is already in the right place right i think the cable just came off the wi-fi cable
Okay, so this is your M.2 original drive. If it's too small and you want to upgrade to a larger one, you can just simply remove that one screw, slide it to your left to remove it. And assuming this is your larger one terabyte or two terabyte M.2 drive, and to install it, you just simply slide it to your right, put the screws back in, And now you're all set. You just pretty much upgrade to a larger M.2 drive. Remember earlier in the video, I was telling you that the new M.2 drive is blank, doesn't have a window. If you want to fresh install the windows, you can buy one of these USB windows installer, or you can make your own by going to Microsoft website and get yourself a blank USB um, and create a bootable windows installer okay and for those of you who does not want to lose your windows or your license key or your games or your data you can buy this usb adapter and what you can do is you can clone everything over from the original to the new m.2 drive i made that video separately go check out in the link description below all right so that's pretty much it and you just put the cover back in and put all the screws and there you have it you just upgraded your m.2 drive to a larger one if you find the video is helpful please go ahead and smash the like button i really appreciate you for doing that if you haven't subscribed subscribe to my channel i do make this kind of computer repair videos for you and um, ask me any question comment below i do read i do read your comment and ask me any computer question and I'll try to answer you. Alright, thanks for watching. Bye now.